as we know, Matt and Hannah met at university. They've been together ever since, and it was absolutely wonderful when we found out that they they got engaged. Eight years, wow. Actually more than eight years it is now since we first laid eyes on each other. I'm so grateful that we chose the same course, university. From the flirty moments and innocent hugs shared in the chemistry labs, to me, to me asking for a kiss on a night out and then spending six months dating on the quiet, having a private little romance before I finally asked you out and we told our friends and family and we'd never look back. We've come so far, we've navigated some great times and some sad ones, lots of major life decisions and defining moments. I'm confident it's all been easier than it would have been without each other to lean on. We've had the confidence to step into the unknown and pretty much always come out the other side better for it. I feel so lucky and grateful that you said yes when I proposed, but let's be honest, after cocktails on a beach, post sunset in a five-star resort in Thailand, you weren't, gonna, you weren't gonna say no, were you? I don't think anyone is happier to see Matt get married than our parents. They've been amazing role models for us both throughout the years and seen us through thick and thin, and they are still as loving and caring as ever. It's their love and support that forms the bedrock of this family before you now. The only thing that was missing until today was Hannah. Lucy, to be my wife, to have and to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death us do part. According to God's holy law. In the presence of God, I make this vow. In the presence of God, I make this vow. Hannah, you look stunning today. I can think of no one else I'd rather have join our family or who would be a better wife to Matt than you. You are generous, selfless, loving and kind and you have the ability to manage Matt's massive ego. So hats off to you to that. Steve, Deborah. Um, I'd like to say you have a lot to be proud of in Matt. He's an absolute credit to both of you. He's a loving young man who's very mature and obviously loves Hannah with all of his heart. I know what I see in Matt. I see my best friend, who I've always looked up to, someone who no matter what will always be there for me. Someone who always gives sound advice, despite taking about 20 minutes to actually get to the point. <laughs> Someone who always gives 100% to whatever he does. <laughs> the only thing left to say is that I wish you both good fortune, good health and eternal happiness in everything you do. This has been a fantastic year. You've got married, you've got a new house, and you've got a fantastic future ahead.
seriously, words can't describe how beautiful you look today. Just knowing I'm sharing the rest of my life with you makes me feel like I've already succeeded. I love that we are a perfectly balanced seesaw in our stubbornness and opinions, and when we do argue, we put it aside and put it behind us because it isn't worth it. smile, laugh and fall for you more every day and I've been looking forward to this day for a long time and we'll continue to look forward to the rest of our lives together. There's no one I'd rather have by my side and I hope I make you as happy as you make me. You're so kind, caring, beautiful, clever and talented. You've been a wonderful girlfriend and fiance. I'm so happy to call you my wife.